At least four people have been killed and 150 injured after two commuter trains collided in southern Germany. Rescue teams have been brought in to search for passengers trapped in the wreckage. The cause of the collision is not yet known. The German police have described the crash as one of the worst in the region for several years. Business magnet Michael Bloomberg today confirmed that he is indeed considering running in the US presidential race. The billionaire media baron statement puts to rest weeks of media speculation. Bloomberg is likely to run as an independent and will have to register his nomination by early March if he wants to mount a serious challenge. Former Nepalese Prime Minister Sushil Koirala died today at the age of 79 after losing a battle to a chronic respiratory problem. The President of the Nepali Congress died at his residence. His body will now be taken to the party's central office at Kathmandu for the public to pay their respect. Koirala had recently returned from the US after successfully undergoing treatment for lung cancer. He is credited for promulgating the new constitution of Nepal in September last year. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash etnow and don't forget to click the like button. You can also follow us on Twitter at etnowlive. To stay updated with all our programming, hit the subscribe button on our YouTube channel by logging on to youtube.com slash user slash etnow.